Hey, this is Joe from SoFly, and in this video, we are going to migrate Gravity Forms entries from one WordPress site to another using WPL export and WPL import. So here on my export site, you can see that I have a Gravity Form for job applications, and we have a bunch of entries here from applicants who've applied for the job. We have about 5,423 of them. So to get started with the export, we're going to go down here to All Export and click New Export. And then down here, we're going to select Gravity Forms entries. And we'll select the job applications form. And we can see it's picked up all the entries that are going to be exported. Over here, we have our filtering options. So if we just wanted to export some of the entries, like uh, based on date or if they had a file or not, we could do that. But we're going to migrate everything. If we needed to customize the export, uh, depending on what data we wanted to include or process it in some way, uh, we could customize it here. But in this case, we're just going to use all the default settings and click migrate entries. Uh, over here, we're just going to leave all this as it is. Don't need to make any changes there. And then we're going to confirm and run the export. So this is going to take a few minutes. We'll let it run and we will come back when it's finished. Okay, so the export is complete and we have two options here. We can download our CSV that has all of our gravity for his entries in it that we just exported. Or what we're going to do is download the bundle which is actually a zip file that has the CSV in it, along with a settings file for WPL import. So we'll download that. And then we're gonna head over here to our import site. And you can see here that I've already imported and migrated over my gravity forms. So this is the form itself, right? The job applications form. We just use the standard import export feature built into gravity forms and it moves the form, but it doesn't move the entries. Uh, check out the description below for a link to their documentation and how that works, it's super simple. So once you get that set up, then we're going to go down here to all import and select a new import. And then we're going to upload the file that we just downloaded, which is right here. This is our gravity forms bundle from WPL export. And you can see here, it's already pre-configuring everything for us. If we want to configure the import, we can continue to step two, but in this case, we're going to skip step four and just use all of the default settings. And the unique identifiers are already set for us. We're going to leave all this with as the default settings. And then we're just going to continue and confirm and run the import. Now this is going to take a few minutes. It's going to take a little bit longer than the export because we have to download all of those files. We'll let this run and we'll come back when it's finished. All right, so the import is complete. That didn't take too long. Let's go ahead and check out our entries and make sure everything came in okay. Check out Anne's application here. And check out her PDF. Yep, her resume came in okay. And we have the date. So let's check out Anne over here. We'll go over to job applications entries. Pull this one up. And there she is, the time matches. The resume's here. And that's all it takes to migrate gravity form entries from one website to another using WPL export and WPL import. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.